Welcome to the world of prehistoric arachnids. Today, we're counting down the top five prehistoric spiders that could eat birds. Yes, you heard that right. Spiders that hunted and devoured birds. At number five, we have the Mongol arachne Jurassica. This spider lived during the Jurassic period and spun massive orb webs. While we can't be sure it ate birds, its size and web-building prowess suggest it was a formidable hunter. Imagine a spider the size of your hand. The Mongol arachne gives us insight into the early evolution of web-building spiders, Dr. Arya Reed, an expert paleontologist, explained on screen with an academic tone. Its existence proves that sophisticated hunting strategies were present much earlier than previously thought. Coming in at number four is Megarachne cervini. Though initially misidentified as a giant spider, later evidence suggests it was actually a large sea scorpion. If it were a spider, its enormous size, over a foot long, would easily make it capable of preying on small vertebrates. For our list, we're considering the initial, albeit incorrect, identification. Regardless of its true nature, Megarachne captures the imagination. The thought of such a massive arachnid stalking the Carboniferous period is certainly terrifying. Number three on our list is a hypothetical spider. While we have no direct fossil evidence of bird-eating spiders from the Cretaceous period, the presence of early birds and large ambush predator spiders suggests that such a predator-prey relationship could have existed. Let's call this hypothetical spider Avis venator, the bird hunter. Imagine Avis venator blending seamlessly with the foliage, waiting patiently for an unsuspecting avian meal to venture too close. At number two, we have spiders from the Eocene epoch. While specific species aren't confirmed as bird eaters, fossilized spider webs have been found containing the remains of small insects and even tiny lizards. Extrapolating from these findings, it is plausible that larger spiders could have occasionally captured and consumed very small, newly hatched birds. Fossilized webs are rare treasures. They offer us a glimpse into the diets and hunting behaviors of ancient spiders, Dr. Chen, a paleobiologist, explained scientifically. The potential for discovering evidence of bird predation is definitely there. And finally, at number one, we have the Palpamanus gibbalus. While not directly known to eat birds, modern relatives of this spider are known to occasionally prey on small vertebrates, including lizards and frogs. Considering their size and hunting techniques, it's entirely plausible that a larger prehistoric version could have taken down a fledgling bird.